Kayleen McCaw here, the old white lady, life cycle celebrant in Sarasota, Florida, resident of the New World. Now, if you want to know why I call myself an old white lady, visit my website, like I've been telling you, at KayleenMcCaw.com. There's a video there that kind of lays it all on the line for you. I'm owning every three one of those words, and if you take umbrage at any one of them, that's a good reason to find out what the hell I'm talking about when I wear the badge of owl with pride. Enough said. While you're there, click on the link at the top of the page, pick up your free copy of The Next Step, and uh, take it. Take the next step toward having a life that's magic, because I know as for me, if my life is not going to be sacred and magical and filled with wonder, I quit. Because what the world has to offer out there is so depressing and normal and devoid of hope that I'm not interested in participating. That's why I moved here to the new world. That's why I have consciously dug myself into the process of riding this wave because you know what I'm talking about you're getting buffeted by the wave and scrubbed in the sand or you're getting on your surfboard and you're leaping on top of it we're going someplace because I gotta tell you when I go out into the old world I have to put on a diving suit of perfect love or I just get swamped you know what I'm talking about I went to the mall today. Bold, I know. Not something I normally would have done, but my daughter offered to pierce my front helix, and I tell you, she's got the goods. Gwen McCaw, piercer on Facebook. You'll like it. But at the mall, holy cow, talk about a cauldron of all of the despair and self-protective that you ever wanted to avoid in the world. It has its full expression in that place as people battle for the really valuable things in life like parking spaces. The mall is not fun for an empath. The mall's not fun for anybody, but it's especially not fun for an empath. So my daughter's been working at the mall for a couple of years now, and she has taken the standard defense of just putting up a shell between her and all of the crazy that's out there in the world. But here's the problem with that. When you shield yourself against the existential loneliness of our world, you're taking part in it. Damn, I hate when that happens. When the losers win by losing. It's just not fair that we have to be the spiritual grown-ups all the time. But we do. Because we are. The only meaningful, truly powerful response to the sucking vortex of agony that is the old world is to go out into it on purpose, armed with the only weapon that always wins, and that is perfect love. There is no other way to avoid being sucked under the wave and crushed into the sand. You have to go out there with the knowledge of the glory of the oneness in which we truly live and give it as a gift. And that is I am calling forth the new world that we all would rather be living in. And I'm choosing to be there, no matter what scary stories are presented in the media. No matter what anybody else might decide they need to suffer, I am deciding to be in the new peace now. I choose peace. I give you peace. That is what I bring into the world that maintains my peace, and I become a contagion of peace. Catch the virus and spread it. Go ahead. Because we can make this thing magic. I'm Kayleen McCaw, celebrating life in Sarasota. Glad to have you with me.